what key aspect do you bring to the team? And what skill that you feel like you shine a little differently? My understanding of the game. What's your biggest challenge, you would say, owning a PR firm? Oh, my God. I'd say the biggest challenge is not only getting the attention. Did you ever picture yourself going into, like, football recruiting, or did you have, like, a different path you wanted to take in sports? <sighs> That's a great question. So I really – no, yes and no. Do you have like a vision for the next 10 years you see for Paddle Diva? I see. Is there fine lines when you're getting these endorsements about like using UCLA's name or are you reaching out? Like, how did that, how did you get known for being like the king of endorsements? Right. Um, you know, it's still an ongoing process. How was your experience at Wake Forest? I know you were there for a little bit and you ended up at OU, but. How would you describe your experience within that football program than OU? In what ways do you take on a leadership role within the team? Um, You know, this is my third year, so just stepping up. At How'd you get connected with OU through your high school recruiting process? So I was always like an OU fan. What would you consider your uh, greatest strength as a baseball player? Hmm. Just try not to let the moments get too big. Just, you know, remember I've been practicing and playing for years and years and years. Transitioning from, you know... OSU to Oklahoma is a really big move. Is there a reason why you left? No, I mean, I just, there's a lot of injuries, you know, I tore my ACL two times in a year and they're just tough on me, you know, like just being around the stadium.